Thursday, February 19th. I'm Jessica Greif. Your Midday Minute starts now. It's the most viewed article on Oregon Live today, the unexpected death of one of the most beloved Portland Trailblazers. We are looking more into what happened to 52-year-old Jerome Kersey. He died last night after being rushed to a Tualatin hospital. Share your favorite memories about Kersey and hear what other fans have to say about his life on Oregon Live. Also, a sentencing today for one of the most bizarre fraud cases in Oregon. Fortune teller Rachel Lee conned Gaston Tree Farm heir Ralph Rains from his $15 million fortune. It's a story with so many weird twists and turns. You'll want to read the full report from the Oregonian's Brian Denson. She's facing nine years in prison. New emails that have been leaked show former Governor John Kitzhopper enabled his fiancee Sylvia Hayes in her mix of private and public roles. Read more about the plans she had for publicity and book deals about her and Kitzhopper. We've linked you in this post. Looking to live simply and in a small space? Tiny houses are a big deal at the Portland Home and Garden Show that kicks off today. Stay tuned for an inside look at the latest on how to obtain this compact lifestyle. To learn more about the stories just mentioned, we've linked you to them in this post at OregonLive.com slash Jessica. Also, a reminder to send in weather photos or any photos in nature, and we will use them in Friday's Midday Minute as we preview the weekend forecast. You can tweet them to at Jessica D. Greif or email the photos to jgreif at Oregonian.com. Thanks for watching Midday Minute. I'm Jessica Greif. Have a great day.